gentle, Phil. Be gentle. It's the Brazilian Grand Prix. Three rounds to go. Will we see a new champion crowned here today? Jake from the front. Flexi and Jonathan Fanzar is a little further down this time round, but of course Flexi's strong point is not qualifying. It is the race. Paul looking to take the lead from Jake. A is in there too. In third is John is in fourth, the sole manor driver, looking to win the constructors for his team. Paul McGee looking for what be his second win of the season. Up the inside of Jay. Can he make it stick? It'll be some move. They're side by side. They don't want to come together. Oh, Paul's on the grass. Loses control of the car and somehow avoids an incident. Aiden did very well to stay out of that one. He's third for now, but Paul remains second. And Flexi Dora is just on the outside. Of side. Fourth Jonas. and fifth. Championship rivals. Fourth and fifth. Jonas needs to score big points if he is a serious threat to win this championship. But Phil Bardwell is giving Jonas more trouble. He goes up the inside and tries to take fifth from him. And indeed he does. Phil Bardwell's the most Jonas who's now been attacked by the two Ferrari drivers. Q and Jack Gooding all over him. And now Jack Gooding up the inside. Can he to make Jonas another position? No. The two Ferraris, Conrad and Just Yet, who are now under attack oh. from Andy. Fucking hell. He Fights all over the field, but John has knows that if Flexi outscores him by seven points in this race, the championship is over, and Flexi will be crowned the new drivers' champion as Andy. Not the inside of Jack Gooding. Oh, again involved two. There's five, six cars off by the seven downwards. There's a car spinning around in the background. I'm not quite sure who it was, but it's Flexi who's in fourth position behind Aiden, Paul, and Jake. The front three Mercedes having a great end to the season. And of course taking the win at Singapore, Jake now on two wins. Is he a real title threat for the next season? Bill Fargo will be happy with a solid start in fifth place. But John has needs to do something very soon. This championship will be over. <laughs> Andy now looking to close in on John as he's got Jack Gooding. Owen Quenby, Leon Griffiths right behind him, and Jack Gooding now the first to make a move at the final corner. He backs out of it, he's going to wait for his opportunity. And now his cars are behind him, and moves need to be made soon, as Phil Fardwell looks to get the move on the second title contender. He's already passed John, as can he do the same to Flaxi? I think he's too far back to a move into turn one, as Paul's still harassing Jake. Both of them after another win, it's been fantastic seasons for them. Will they both be championship contenders? Next time round, next season is wide open, but for this race, finally, some great action tonight. As Paul takes the lead of the race, but Jake fights back. They're going side by side again. And this is brilliant stuff. As Andy goes off in the background, it's all happening. Jack Pierce and Aiden get pit stop already, but it's Jake who still leads from Paul. And Aiden Flexi and Phil, the top five, so close. And John is struggling to do anything about them. Jonas can see his title hopes going. It might not be mathematically over after tonight, but it will be realistically. Jonas could do with a strong haul of points in the remaining three races, and he needs to start with a result here. Only second in Mexico, only eight points gained on his title rival. As Jake now looks to pull away from Paul McGee. Paul now seven tenths off. Under attack from Aiden, who's on attack from Flexi, who's been raked by Phil Bardwell. Phil Bardwell, down five pounds. Can he gain a position on the Renault driver? Flexi surely won't fight too hard. Phil oh, Bardwell spins himself round and takes Flexi with him. And that's taken Phil out of the race. Flexi and Phil come together, and Flexi's tyre makes contact with Phil's, and in turn, Phil is out of the race, and the virtual safety car is deployed once again tonight. 